Adjustable building columns are designed as durable, safe, permanent building supports for both new home construction and remodeling. They arrive fully assembled and easy to install. Here's how. First, make sure you've selected the correct size, strength, and number of columns for your project based on the construction documents available in many sizes for virtually every residential application. Determine the correct locations for the footer pads that will support the columns. Make sure these foundations are fully capable of supporting the load carrying beam and are sited directly under each beam so each column will be both perfectly level and vertically plumb once installed. Install footer pads according to the material instructions as directed. When pads are ready for column installation, prepare each column by turning the adjustment nut so the column is slightly shorter than the length required between the load carrying beam and the footer. Then, place columns vertically between beam and pad with the adjustable end down. Tamper-proof installation requires that the adjustment nut and screw be at the footer. Now turn the adjustment nut at the bottom of the column to lengthen the column and wedge it into position between the pad and the beam. Make sure the column is firmly centered directly under the load carrying beam, vertically plumb and level. To secure the column footer to the pad, drill holes using the pre-drilled footer plate as a guide and secure with appropriate fasteners. To secure the column header to the beam, Drill holes using the pre-drilled header plate as a guide and secure with appropriate fasteners. If using the H header plate, bend the flanges up and around the beam. If the load-bearing beams are wood, use the grabber saddle plates to secure column headers to beams. First, attach the grabber saddle plate to the top of the column by inserting and securing with nuts and bolts. Next, place assembled column vertically between footer and beam and turn adjusting nut to desired height. Drill holes using the pre-drilled grabber saddle plate as a guide and secure with appropriate fasteners on both sides of beam. During construction, additional screw adjustments may be made as necessary. When the concrete basement floor is poured, it will encase the footer, adjustment nut and screw, permanently locking the column correctly in place. Always consult local building codes for specific requirements in your area. And remember, if you modify the columns in any way or install them in any way other than shown here, a special inspection in accordance with IRC-IBC may be required to be compliant.